All right, here we go. The best grilled cheese sandwich in the world with tomato. I'm gonna take a slice of cheese and put it on each piece of bread. We're making one sandwich each for this guy. Sorry if the cheese is a little tore up. Let's tear it a little bit. Um, we're using whole wheat, uh, multi-grain sort of type of bread. It's okay, not the best, but it's, it'll do for right now. For you. We're gonna take a slice of tomato. Garlic powder. Sprinkle this on it. This does something magical for it. Close them up. Close up the bread. Go over here. We have warm. I'm going to take a nice piece of butter. I think I have a little too hot. I'm turning it down some. Take a nice piece of butter and throw the sandwich on here. Okay, you want to throw yours on there, sir? Alright. Yeah, yours is kind of slipping all over the place. It's alright. So we're gonna leave it on each side for probably about two to three minutes just to allow the bread to get nice and crispy and allow the butter to get down in there and uh, really make it nice. So hold on, we'll be right back. But I know you will. Okay, so, um, you know, you may say, oh, cheese sandwich is not the best, but it's not that bad because we're using 100% whole grain, whole wheat bread. And we're using butter. Smart. Smart balance. It's non-GMO. It's dairy-free butter. So it's a balance. Plus we have tomato on there and garlic. So there's a balance. Okay, you can have yourself a cheese sandwich. It's not going to die. Mmm, look at that. That's how it's supposed to look, right? Mm-hmm. Some people have cheese sandwiches, grilled cheese sandwiches with like tomato soup. Or a salad. Yeah. They just dip it in ketchup. Oh, I've never tried that. Okay. Good. Good. Making way of doing things. Cheers, man. Are you gonna try yours? I wanna see. Take a bite. Come on, take a bite. Fine. All right. Thank you. Thanks, hubby, for the grilled cheese sandwich. Oh yeah, baby. Let's go, baby. There you go. I like steals better. 